Peace family, Dickie Dillard here. Thank you so much for tuning in to African Diaspora News Channel. Be sure to give us a big thumbs up and share the broadcast. Okay, family, I want you to get ready to watch this clip of this so-called elegant Asian femininity coach, TikToker. She got dragged, rightfully so, for something that she said referring to uh, dark-skinned women. Watch this. Makeup mistakes elegant ladies never make. Great brown lipstick with gloss on top of it or lining your lips in the dark lip liner. I saw ladies using contouring to contour their lips, hoping to achieve an effect of larger lips. It looks ridiculous. Yes, ma'am. Yes, girl. That's all I'm going to say on that. It's really, really something. Me, as an individual, for example, the hate and... Um, the unfortunate criticism that we as black women are subjected to. It doesn't matter about my autoimmune illness I've dealt with for years. It doesn't matter uh, where um, I source my resources from. It doesn't matter that there are tiny curly braids. Um, it doesn't matter people not understanding uh, what happens with my body and my skin and my lips and my blood and other body parts because of what I'm overcoming. Uh, it's just the hate and the disgusting things that I hear, even from our own people. And so what's so fascinating is notwithstanding, if you do a simple Google search of ancient styles, you will find that both black men and black ancient women wore all types of extensions from not only human hair, but grains and other particles that were used to extend their hair and it represented status. It represented so many other wonderful things. Because we are beings, we're more than what meets the eye. So some of us actually know who we are, so we're not emulating the enemy. And the massive ignorance that's pushed by our own people concerning so-called Caucasian hair that you claim that's in the store, these types of things, most of the times that's absolutely not it, and it's a thousand percent not the case for me. We must be careful, dear family, how we yap about our mouths because we give the world permission to do other diabolical things against us. And it works against us in so many other ways. So when our sister, Jackie Ina, who is also a very well-known cosmetic industry person, breaks down why Black women use, for example, in this instance, a brown lip liner. We shouldn't have to be subjected to that as the original woman on the planet. Talk black to me, somebody. We know sometimes in any situation, people tend to embellish too much or overdo it too much. We don't need your two cents. If it's not your man, if it's not your family, then what do I need to hear from you for? The same way some of your houses don't necessarily need color or a certain type of furniture, but you want to embellish it according to your own liking. We need to keep the main thing the main thing and be careful that we don't add to the undoing of our own people. Shout out to our sister Jackie I'm that snatched this lady all the way together. Watch your mouth. My name is Vicky Diller. Be sure to join my supernatural mastermind school at clubvicky.com. The link is below. Be sure to share the broadcast here on African Diaspora News. I can't wait to see you again.